again, everybody. Welcome to another Racehorse Tavern Spring Training Report here from People's Bank Park today. Daryl Henry with Rev Second Baseman Jack Kenley. We just finished up a beautiful day of workouts, some intra squad stuff here at the ballpark today. So, Jack, we welcome you onto the program here for a couple of minutes. And what's it been like? You've been here for almost a full week. How's it feel to be back towards season mode again? I, it's been a lot of fun. Um, I know a lot of the guys, when you ask them how their offseason went, they all say it was long. Um, but it's finally uh, come time. I, I'm happy to say that I, I feel like I brought some warm weather with me too from the south. So uh, enjoying that while we can and getting outside. Yeah, thank you for that. What did you do with your offseason? What was memorable? Uh, so, I mean, I, I, had, I had a ton of time. So I spent some time with the family in South Carolina um, working out. Um, took some flight school there just for fun and uh, continue to try to get stronger. And then when I went to Fayetteville, Arkansas, I trained up at their new facility and uh, tried to face as much live as I could. And before you know it, I mean, I had to, had to make that long drive from Fayetteville, Arkansas all the way up to York, Pennsylvania. How long did it take you? I split it up, it took me a long time. So I drove from Fayetteville to Memphis to see some friends there, Memphis to Birmingham to see the sister, Birmingham to Anderson to see the family, Anderson to Radford to see the grandparents, <laughs> and Radford here, so. I, I, I didn't kill myself. Flight school? Flight school. Where do you see him with that? Uh, so, don't have the pilot's license. Uh, got really, really close, and then scheduling just kind of got to where I was. I was like, man, I don't want to, don't want to waste any more time. It just makes more sense for me to, to start, you know, committing more time to baseball. So, um, it's a lot, a lot of fun, and it's very little planes. It's kind of daunting at first, but it's, it's pretty cool. Man, what's the adrenaline like? Uh, it's, it's. I would compare it a lot to like a, a down by down by one man on third, less than two outs kind of thing. Um, but but it's it's just kind of. I mean, I, I compare it a lot to uh, to baseball just because we've been put in a lot of very stressful situations, and then um, you want to you want to try to correlate that to some things in life. I mean, there's lots of lots of ways that being in athletics kind of kind of can prepare you for real world things, and uh, calming your nerves is something that is incredibly important when you're sitting in an airplane by yourself. Holy cow. So where do you hope to go with that someday? Hobby or for profession? Uh, it's probably just hobby for right now. Um, but just used it to kill some time. Flight school is right next to the house. So uh, committed some time to that. And got, I got a good way, so. And you'll fly me to Lexington if I buy the plane, Yeah, right? I told you, you okay. buy the plane, I'll fly it for you. All right, so we have no deal at this point on that, but we're working on that. Uh, what have the first few days of workouts been like? How are you feeling? Uh, I feel good. Um, it's just kind of you, you can prepare as, as you know as, as close to 100 percent as you as you want in the off season. No matter what you get into, you know real full speed game speed, it's going to speed you up. And um, I've been pleased with how my body's kind of reacted. Um, I still feel I still feel like I'm I'm almost I'm almost there, getting close. But uh, it's exciting to see how how good and how ready everybody else is as well. Um, so I'm really hopeful for this year, not only for myself, but for the, for the team. And the last couple of days, you faced some live pitching yesterday against Lancaster. Today, some of your own guys. So when you're getting in there, first couple of days of that, what are your focuses for your bats? Um, I really want to be aggressive my first couple of bats, just because I'm not really, um, I'm not really in there to, to take and see uh, how many, how how much I can get on base. And funny enough, that's how this this last two days have worked. Um, in the six at bats, I've walked like four times. Um, but kind of trusting my eyes and not trying to expand my zone too much, but still being aggressive on the, in the zone. Uh, just because you learn more from your from your failures, obviously, than, than just being passive and sitting back. But, uh, but yeah, trying to be aggressive on that kind of stuff, and then in the field and stuff like that. Um, being out, being out there in the infield, I love taking infield. So these last couple of days, doing that every day has been a lot of fun. Well, I did promise everybody yesterday a brief recap of the spring training game. 4-4 tie, for what it's worth. Uh, Elmer Reyes, Troy Stokes both went yard. Pitching looked good. Uh, you're one of the returning guys, Jack, and, and a lot of the guys are back. Handful of new guys. What's what's the group like? You enjoying it so far? I am. I think we got a good mix of uh, of uh, experience, and it seems like some some younger guys too. However, I, I do feel like we are a little bit older, um, and already the team seems to be a little bit uh, a little bit tighter maybe than it was. I can't really say that because I keep late, but uh, but it does seem like everyone's getting along well. Um, 
yeah, I feel like we are mature in the, the way that we went about the game yesterday and we were able to talk to each other and stuff like that. Um, I think that bodes well. Awesome. Well, tomorrow's Fan Fest and before the workout, uh, we've got these egg games on the field involving the guys. So I don't know what you're what you're involved in. Uh, if you had to do a relay race on a spoon, long toss with an egg and not breaking it, uh, or the roulette game, you know, where you smash it on your forehead, whichever one splatters the guys out. Which one do you think you would fare the best in with Ooh. your skill set? Pro you probably stick me something with speed, so I'll, yeah. I'll, I'll take that egg on the spoon. the spoon. Yeah, speed and balance. Oh yeah. Okay. Well, it's not you can you can you can forfeit some balance there. You just got to get the momentum going forward. So it's like the air yeah. pushing back. You know, aerodynamic almost. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We'll keep an eye on that tomorrow. That's some in-depth stuff. But uh, Jack, can't wait to get this season started. Appreciate a few minutes today. Thanks for joining us. You got it. Good to have you back. Jack Henley joining us. This has been today's Racehorse Tavern Spring Training Report. We'll talk to you tomorrow.